Hey guys, so obviously we are pretty much less than a month away now from Supernatural Season 15 and there's a trailer, if you could call it that. Really what this is is just a 40 minute teaser because probably all they have the footage for in terms of rendered, worked through, arable is maybe the first four three episodes. And this is something that actually Supernatural has done for the last like 10 years. They never have a trailer really that actually can show you what's going to happen. I know that they used to have sort of previews of what was going to happen on the next season and they hadn't even started filming yet. And this is just because this is how the show has been filmed throughout its entire runtime. Every season has basically been approved of one at a time. That might have worked for the first five because they were kind of building up to what they originally had as a finale, but then after five, they didn't have an end in sight. They didn't have an ending in terms of what they knew was going to happen. So that's why every season was being made with the idea that it was the last. At least that's how the production was up until 11. And then after 11, I have no idea what's going on. I don't know anyone who's worked on it for the last three years. The people who have worked on it but prior to this have told me what I just told you. What do I think of this trailer? Mm -hmm. They basically kind of lay out what everyone knows. This is the end. They're laying it out as thick as basically they can. <laughs> what did Sam say? We win this. We're free. And they figure out that the monsters come back. We as the audience know that, but the characters don't know that yet because we saw all that fan service bullshit at the end of the last season finale, but the brothers didn't. They just got surrounded by a bunch of zombies, which clearly they survive. Obviously we knew they were gonna survive that, but that's why I, I've i never really watched any of the trailers for the Supernatural seasons or the episodes because one, they're half a minute, if that, and two, they don't, they can't show much because of how they're shooting it. They're literally gathering what they've shot, which is sometimes maybe only a few episodes, sometimes three episodes ahead of when they're showing that trailer, and then they will uh, show that to you. I'm kind of still indifferent. I feel that the God twist was still stupid, horrible writing. I kind of like the idea of all of their adversaries, monsters, creatures, and whatnot coming back, even though it's kind of a little bit iffy of how this happened, how God became just an asshole in like the span of that, but that's Andrew Dad's writing. This is the final season of the show. Whether I have even though I have been judgmental and critical of its bad writing for the last three seasons, I still will watch this to its end because I just want to see how it ends. This is the longest I've ever committed to a show in my life. In most of your lives, most likely. Because nothing's ever run this long. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you liked it. And if you did, leave a like. And if you're interested in more, maybe subscribe. Give me your thoughts of... What you got from that trailer, there's not a lot to take from it, but but we'll see. Anyways, see you guys next time. Thanks for watching the video. To see any and all updates about the upcoming Undergrads movie, be sure to check out and like the Bring Back Undergrads Facebook page. And with any luck, we'll see you guys soon.